शेरूप मंजिल कदाचित पाद गोष्ठंग नंदन पूजा राधिका गिविंग इज हर हेड ऑन द लाइफ ऑफ कृष्ण she will try to sleep like her krishna curiosity crossing her oh this and krishna oh watch her wait wiping his wiping her sweats how glorious this is and rupmanjari what messaging her rati manjari Or others, friend. Oh, friend, I mean, be so lucky and fortunate that Sirup Manjari kindly she will call me. Come on, come on. Take some remnants. And what remnants? What guy? What she was message to you? What message? Oh, just a group. And take it, she get this remnant. to rabnath ashkusha in his gopi form transcendental form <laughs> and thus he was waiting bitter melted heart and then he realized the mercy of shilarup manjari he is telling padadyo stava pina bharat dina bhartasya me nanat padapi samaye kila dev jati सत्ताये मम नमस्त नमस्त नित्यम दास्यायते मम इफ कृष्ण कम्स एंड टेल्स दैट ऑल यू शुड है डेक्शन वॉट यू वॉक ओ आई हैव एन इंजेक्शन टू टेक नॉट प्रहलाद महाराज लाइक प्रहलाद महाराज टोल दैट आई हैव आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू हैव एनी पेन इंजेक्शन ओ He is telling that I want benediction. And what? Oh, to Radhika. Hey, Radhika, I don't want to be your sati. Oh, I am doing namaskar, millions of namaskar in your lotus feet. I don't want to be your sati like Lalita Bhushan. I want to serve you like Rukmini and others. So, namaskar. Uh, I want that to serve Radhika. In Radhika happiness, I want to be happy. In her <coughs> separation room, I will be how to oh, to give sahayata, console her, assist her, assist her. How many things? Yet pray to Krishna. Oh, hey, Gokul, Sudhakar, Suprasanna, Bhaktar, Vinda, Madhuras, Mithe, Kibatra, Toya, Dirahite, Pranayi, Kriya, Arad, Tapai, Maman, Apinay, Kriya, Sevanaya. I cannot be a separation. All day. Oh, Gokul, Chandra, Moon of Gokul. Very soon you should take at once. You should take me where your Radhika is there and engage in her service. Otherwise, I don't want to you. I don't want to brother. I don't want anything. That's it. If she is working with you, I want to fall. But. I cannot be there. But if Radhika is there, I may. But if you are with thousands of sixteen thousand of uh, Rukmini Shakti Bhama and others, oh, I don't want to go. I will never go. If you request even, I will. It is there. 
बट देन आई विल हियर ओ राधिका इज देयर ओ राधिका माय मास्टर माय स्वामिनी जी देन व्हाट क्विकली वेरी क्विकली ओ आई विल फ्लाई देयर फॉर द सर्विस ऑफ राधिका सो हिज मूड इज लाइक आशा भाई अमृत सिंह माये कांचित कालो मया की कविता के साम्प्रतम ही पंचेत विधास्य से कहीं वो नहीं है प्राणी न प्रजेय न बरोड़ बकार ओ आशा I was in a hope that one day I can serve my Radhika at least that hope is not fulfilled At once I will give up my life. I don't want Krishna. I don't like Govardhan, Radha, Kunda, or anything. So this is highest class of <coughs> love and affection of the Lord Shri Krishna. There are so many things, so many things. So in Chaitanya 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 Amrita Chaitanya Chaitanya, Sri Sri Guru Harakunath. पदे चार आठ चैतन्य चरिता दो सुन दो मसी ऑफ रूप गोस्वामी एंड रघुनाथ गोस्वामी फॉर दिस आई एम राइट टू प्लीज हो रूप एंड रघुनाथ सी रूप एंड रघुनाथ सी रूप रघुनाथ पदे हई पे आपूति कब आम बुझा बसे जुगल प्रीति सी रूप रघुनाथ पदे रघु मोर आस प्रार्थना और गुरु परंपरा जवान टू सर्व लोड स्ट्रीट ऑफ रूप एंड रघुनाथ दास स्वरूप रघुनाथ दास गोस्वामी की बट यू हैव नॉट टू जम्प देयर You will have to begin from begin from root, and how? Then you will have to come down to the root. In life and his teaching, teachings, oh, you should try to obey and follow. And Bhakti Shar Maharaj will tell something about Prahlad Maharaj and his teachings, teaching especially to the demon boys. You come late, late Maharaj, <laughs> and later Maharaj. Om Namah Shivaya. 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 Shri Guru Devas, for him to speak something from Prahlad Charita, the seventh canto, Shri Bhagavatam. Uh, this uh, long history, one thing on, I remember, in India we have seen many old persons, very old, they can sit on chairs, but here I am seeing that all, all the young boys, they have their more. Older than Vishnu, and sixty years old. It seems that they are of eighty years. They cannot see like them, and that is why they don't want to be to learn anything. Some come very near, and here they are following. They should not be follow older person. Always very energetic, like Ramnath Das Goswami. He travelled one month past in Mali, but without nothing, eating and nothing. Never he rested. Oh, went on, went on, running, running. But I see here in Western country, old person are here sitting on the ground, and new boys, children, oh, they are. Oh, this is not be like that. 
So Prahlad Maharaj was uh, in the womb of his mother, uh, Kayadu, uh, given shelter in the ashram of Srinara Muni, while his father was uh, doing austerities. Rani Kachapu was doing austerities to get the universe under his control. So for thousands and thousands of years, while he was doing his austerities, Kayadu took shelter at the ashram of Nardarishi. And even though she herself was not uh, so much attached to hearing Harkatva, still she was able to hear from Narada so many beautiful instructions. And the child in her womb was, uh, became Shuddha Bhakta, pure Bhakta, from hearing these instructions. So later she returned to the palace of her husband, and Prahlad was raised in the palace, and then it came time to go to school. So his father, being king of the universe, naturally he wanted his son to follow in his footsteps and become very powerful eh, at politics, controlling friends and enemies, knowing the art of divide and conquer, how to extract so much money for enjoyment and power, and also how to be very attractive to so many women. Uh, the father's name was Hiranya Kashifu. Hiranya means gold, and Kashifu means soft bed. So this indicates the two principal activities of this gentleman. And he was hoping his son will follow in my line. So Pallad was, it was established that he would go to a very fine school of all the young sons of the great and powerful demoniac kings of the universe and associate with you know, the right class of boys, so he would be their leader. But because his mind was Krishna consciousness, it was so saturated in Krishna Bhakti Ras Bhavita Matehi, was saturated in Krishna consciousness, when he, he would hear all the instructions of diplomacy and politics and ruling and conquering and dividing and like this, he did not pay any heed to it. And simply he was uh, listening uh, he was remembering Krishna all the time. So after some while, uh, he came back to his father, and his father asked him, My dear son, what have you learned in this school of yours? And he said, Actually, I've not learned anything of value in this school, my dear father. Uh, the, the, I'm only interested in Krishna consciousness. So his father was at first amused by this. Oh, this little boy, he doesn't understand anything and he instructed the teachers. Now you'd be very careful and teach him very strictly Krishna consciousness. They took him back to the school. At one time, he, they were going to have to go do some other errands and they told the Prahlad, now you and the boys, you'd be very good, you monitor everyone, we're going to be back soon. So at that time the boys thought, oh, let us all play now. We're all five years old, teachers are gone, Let's not waste time studying and learning, let's have fun. And they said, come on, Prahlad, let's have fun. And Prahlad said, no, we should not waste a moment of time. We should be Krishna conscious now. We should take this opportunity. They said, oh, come on, Prahlad, we're very young now. We should enjoy our life. Well, maybe when we're old, then we can take to Krishna consciousness. Oh, uh, it's the fag end of our life, when we can't enjoy these senses anymore then we'll become religious. That's, that's the way to be religious, when you're old, not when you're young. So, Prahlad Maharaj said, Komarama chet pragyo dharmam bhagavatam niha That actually, one should begin this Krishna consciousness when he's very young, Komar. Why? Because actually everyone is old. What does it mean to be old? To be old means you are about to die. And isn't it a fact? Everyone in this world is about to die. No one can say at what moment death will come. I noticed on the way in the door, you are honoring these seven astronauts who were just now killed upon re-entry into this atmosphere. Huh. So this is a very nas a national tragedy. Everyone is very sympathetic for their poor families for this mission, but actually, and no one could have foretold, no? everyone knew there was some danger, but no one could have foretold, everything seemed like a perfect mission, even in the re-entry, everything was, and then suddenly one little thing started to go wrong, then another little thing, and the sensors started going, and then suddenly, whole machine blew up in outer space, 
and now they're picking up the pieces all over the countryside. So no one could have predicted this, what tragedy would happen. So actually we are old right now, Prahlad said. Don't waste another minute. We don't know. He says, what, what is this human form of life? Hmm? Say we have 100 years. What's going to happen? Uh, 50 years, half our time spent in sleep. So now, actually we only have 50 years. And during the first 25 years of our life, or so, 20, 20 years of life, we're simply children, and we're playing, and we're getting our education, and so we don't have very much time for doing any bhajan and sadha. So in this way, now 60 so years are gone, then uh, in our youth, uh, from 20 to 50, we are very busy in uh, establishing a relationship with a member of the opposite sex, getting a house, having children and working so hard to end so the children have good education and the toys they need to be happy and all the nice things that they want that they see on the television and now they want these things so we have to work hard for all these things entertainment and so now another uh, 15 years or so is lost now 50 years old the senses are beginning to get feeble uh, Things are beginning to weaken, but oh, just when we thought our job was over, children are going up, now we have grandchildren. So nice, another nice little bundle again. It's really amazing, isn't it? My uh, father in this former life, material world, he was the president of a big, big corporation. He had a big skyscraper building on Park Avenue in New York, one of the most prestigious city and street in America. These well, one end down to Wall Street, the financial center of the world. And then up and on this building was right on Wall Street. A monument to the material civilization. So when our Nityalita Prabhishta Vishnupad, Astajasav Sisma, Bhakti Vedanta Swami Prabhupada, who spread Krishna consciousness throughout the world in the 60s and 70s. When he first came to New York and he was driving up Park Avenue, the sannyasis in the car said, Oh, Srila Prabhupada, there is Krishna Duna's father's building. It is the largest liquor company in the world. They are selling more alcohol, one billion dollars every year. And Srila Prabhupada went, Liquor? He run near Kashi <laughs> So, there, now, this man who was president of such a big company selling one billion dollars liquor, and now at 83, actually is the same age as my actual spiritual father, Srila Gurudev. But what is the difference at this time? <laughs> big difference. At 83 years old now, he's sitting at his desk, blind with diabetes from a life of rich food and lack of exercise and he's crying constantly he doesn't know why so unhappy with life stock market problems so many things shuffling papers on his desk he can't understand any more to read than what is going on he's losing control of all his affairs this is controlling big corporation and sometimes drooling uncontrollably uh, sometimes making noises like and also going Alzheimer's, the brain is gone, not recognizing his family anymore, who they are, who is his wife, who is his son, and speaking like this. And we think, oh, how sad. This man, who is so powerful, who did so many things, now he has been reduced to this very unfortunate position. But then we see a little baby. Doesn't recognize his parents or anything, what is what, drooling, go back and go and think, oh, how cute. <laughs> but neither it is cute in the baby, and neither it is sad in the old man. This is just all karma and a waste of time to be without Krishna consciousness. We are wasting our time. So, one morning walk in Hawaii, on Maui, on the beach, Srila Gurudev, he asks, 
my, uh, at that time, 14-year-old son. So what are you thinking, young man? And he said, I am thinking, Sheila, your day, that when I am your age, I would rather be like you than like my grandfather. And Sheila Gurde said, he embraced him and said, you are my real disciple. So, Prahlad Maharaj was like this, teaching the boys, don't be foolish, don't waste your life in games, and a uh, hundred years will go before you know it, and then old age, 50 years is coming, and the power of the senses is dwindling, diminishing. Then how will you practice bhajan? At 67 years old, if you have not practiced while you are young, it will not be possible. You will have to take birth again according to your karma, as Shukhat Bhaktivedanta Maharaj has so vividly described. So, Prahlad Maharaj gave the same warning to his young boyfriends. Don't waste this valuable human form of life in which you can become Krishna conscious. Hare Krishna.
Sindhi Mrimedya. Lotus feet of Krishna is sought by Vedas. They cannot achieve. But if anyone <coughs> remember gopis and especially Radhika, Krishna, he can go. Jhava is Vyarchit. Ajahvi ni apta kamai. Jo vaisvare rati jadat manji rasa dushtya. Krishna satat bhagavata charana manji. Nastam tanis pijahu parikar. Oh, Lord Feet of Krishna is very, very much too long. Right. So, even Lakshmi, oh, Brahma, Shankar, and all the Aktarishi, Yogeshwari Rapi, oh, they worship Lakshmi, and very hard to have her mercy. What to tell the Lord feet of Krishna? Very rare, very rare for Yogeshwar Api. Yogeshwar means Brahma, Shankar, or Shukadev, Krishna, and others. Very rare. But Gopis Vati, that very rare Lord of Feet of Krishna, they put on their breast. And they make Bihau Parigam Dhatakam and they उसको ताप जो हृदय में हो रहा था उसको शांत किया कृष्ण के चरणों को रख करके बाय होल्डिंग द लोटस फीट ऑफ कृष्ण अपन देर ब्रेस्ट दे ड्रोव अवे द द बर्निंग सेंसेशन ऑफ द लव फॉर कृष्ण दैट वाज गिविंग देम सो मच अफ्लिक्शन सो बिगेन Andi, 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 Yeshti. Padayenu Mavishna Sabjasam Parikototi, Unabhutoma. Oh, and pray the Lord's feet of it. And the Bandana of Lord's feet of it. Raja Ishtena, all the Gopis of Nandaba, Hide. Even one particle of their dust. It means that we want one dust of Radhika lotus feet. So this great pranam and bandana to gopi lotus, lotus dust jasam. The gopis in separation mode. What they told? He heard. No. We are Krishna is our most eager. And he is very soft. If he will hear that we are all dying in the separation of Krishna, then hearing this Krishna may give up his life. He is very soft. Don't tell. You can tell oh, very what? Very minute. And then, like if there is a uh, old Cloth. Now it has become more old. So old. And if there is water, then just a twist, not so hard, that it will break up. Yet, what is there? If you bring out an old piece of cloth forcibly, then the cloth will break into pieces and tear. So, don't tell Krishna all these things, otherwise he will hear. Satan will come and he can sometimes. Don't tell. After that, how bad? He was seeing that hope is high, how high cross of love and all these things. But why Krishna left them? If I will be here, it may be that Krishna did even because he was Mathura, he was the present. Right. So, what did he do? He presented the of Mathura. So, he was feared and he could not be in the association of food. And he came and told Krishna, Krishna was preventing that. 
para todo. Very, very pleased. Anyone who will uh, explain all this, he must be, he will feel separation. Very hard to achieve. But our heart is like a stone, not very. We call it upper heart of heads. If you will make your heart pure, not criticize anyone, don't criticize anyone. Try to follow the Narada Krishna to this issue. And the teachings of Siddhartha Rukhpur Swami, Upadhyay Swami, that very soon you will be very strong and you can feel all these things, weeping and weeping, all the time. And then Krishna and Radha may come and give them. Go Pranana! Now they should bring their arms to Guru Dev while this kid has a spot. This morning, we set off. Guru Dev will announce your name and as you are receiving your name, come and bring your offering also. First, we stand up, Dimitim Buna. Sainas or Lainas Bhumati, Bhuna. Bharat. Bharat. Where is she? Okay. Om Chalum Chandrika Devi Ki. Kirisan Bhojan, please stand up. Bhojan Das Prabhu Ki. Rita Dorshan. Pachu Priya.
Mother Mars. No. There are others there are behind you, right behind you. Son of, you can come and set up your son. <laughs> Maitreya Das Pro, the seat of the station, from Sivita. We will bring your baby for great ceremony. Thank you.